Hi sir, good day. Hi everyone. So my report is all about meaning of globalization. This phenomenon, according to Thomas Friedman, 2000, is called the shrinking and patterning of the world. So shrinking is in Visaya, Pagamay, and patterning, according to Thomas Friedman, patterning is the sense that the competitive playing field between industrial and emerging market countries is leveling and that individual entrepreneurs as well as companies both large and small are becoming part of a large complex. Global supply can change extending across oceans and Friedman also added globalization is not just some economic fashion or a passing trend so, on the word, not just some economic fashion or a passing trend, we do not think that globalization is a joke. We take it seriously because globalization is, it has a big impact to our future. And it is an international system that replaced the Cold War system after the fall of the Berlin Wall. And furthermore, according to Randolph David, 2001 is the process by which money, goods, information, and people move across nations at a pace on a magnitude made possible by rapid advances in communication and technology. And travel, he asserted. This phenomenon is changing the face of human societies, shattering cultures and social system in much the same way as the Industrial Revolution. Significantly, he notes that the rapid expansion of globalization trade resembles what transformed Europe and its colonies 250 years ago. So, globalization is included and affected the whole world if it is continue going down so that thank you this is the first part of developments that characterize globalization the first part is technological revolution Technology is thought to be one of the greatest blessings. Tungon sa technology, mas mapadali pa ang trabaho sa mga tao. About example, na, kan, communication sa lain nga wan, lain nga bansa. Pwede na draw sa cellphone. Pwede na mag, mas mapadali na communicate nila. Yeah. It is an era of accelerated technological progress characterized by new innovation whose rapid application and diffusion typically cause an abrupt change in society. Uh, technological revolution is the introduction of new technologies and machines into the definite spheres of human life, which have such a great impact that change them, motion, and quality of life to some extent. There have been several technologic revolution which changed people's life. For example, uh, the first industrial revolution re replaced handwork which, with the machines and plants and factories were equipped with the machines which did much work automat automatically and started Produce goods much quicker. Ang uh, tungod sa machine mas mapadali na ang kuan. Ganay tama ng tano na namin machine nga mo kuan. Mo trabaho ano? Nya. Nai kuan nai positive o negative yung pagana. Ang positive ana mas kaya tama mas mapadali ang trabaho. Nya ang negative ang mas magkagamay ang kuan. Ang mga trabahante kay mga machine na may trabaho ato. Mo ti yung negative yung pag na pwede ko na na nga mas machine na yung trabaho mas magkabrato na ang mga baligya niya na yung puruhan niya ang mga business mas mo lang mo 
This is the second part of development of characterized globalization. New powerful role of cooperation in our society. Globalization represents a major move from the dominant and powerful role of politics to our cooperation. As multinational cooperation increase in size and power, the control influence in pain the more and more people. In pain have a effect that or impact especially a negative one to to affect in a way that and wanted to have a bad effect, he work is in pain or his social life. The government wants to avoid pain upon the affairs of private citizen. Good morning, sir. This is the continuation about the topic of new powerful role of the community or society. Advances in communication increase consumption of proliferation of mass produced goods and powered by the factories of industrial world. Being able to influence our almost media companies, small multicultural corporations have communicated everything as their primary goal is to profit from anything. World affairs could now be complained as the interaction between what is new product. Service and updated technology since the interaction of internet administration all them is to study in every day. The word span is to deliver, to deliver generated mother propagated bird. There are the four media companies that that mentioned in this topic the new powerful role of the comparison in our societies. The one is the is the compass with Disney, ET and ET, Becamos, CBS, Sunny Vegas, Fox and other. Media company means an enterprise that runs advertisement by converging advertising space in advertising media. There are the example of mass with mass cooperation in this topic the new purple role is the media information and computer and computer or ICT. Technically the mass of small eggs the media such as TV the biggest media con conglomerate in America compares the Walt Disney Company National Amusement with include Bicom or CBS News World or Fox Corporation, which are both owned by the part of the murder sunny and part of communication. Communication is the part of our globalization to represent the major move. Communication is a is a is a deliver to one way to another that they can communicate to one another because communication is the, is the part of the solution because in the world being able to influence our almost media companies are more multinational corporation some companies that can that can imitate the conversation is to is to being a uh, online or online commu online communications through the profit from anything Word of verse called now the big spin in the interruption. That's all, thank you. Good morning, sir. This is the third part of development that characterizes globalizations. Global integration. Global integration that continuous advancement in information and communication technology pushes and sustains the process, process of globalizations. The advent of the internet and social networking sites like Facebook and Twitter has used in a global integration of a variety of people from different cultures, age groups, professions, religions, and, uh, and the social networking sites allows individuals to create new new communities, group, group membership, and relationship with people across the globe. Through using internet as now people that can easily communicate in the other country and also your loved ones and even alarming is the reality that global global integration has altered human consciousness 
human beings today worship money, technology, power, and pleasure, and this becomes the barometers of success of the ultimate goal in life. Anyone who is described described of these positions is not in with the group or do not become successful in the city. And that's all. Four, reduction of trade barriers around the world. So when you say reduction, it is simply means reduced or reduces. And for trade barriers, it means it is lowered or eliminated. According to my research, it is regional agreements are one way to reduce these trade barriers. Other measures such as the reduction of non-tariff barriers and rationalization and harmonization of regulations also aim to facilitate trade. The forces and characteristics of globalization tend to have collapsed traditional boundaries among nations, regions, and among ethnic divides. For example, Trade barriers have gradually been reduced around the world. It has been less restriction on the free flow of investment capital among countries. The opening of international trade provides consumers with a wider variety of goods and services by buying raw materials and hiring workers from other countries. Some businesses nowadays are able to lower their costs these lower costs usually generate prices leading to greater consumers' demand for products of all types. In addition to lower prices, international competition results in higher quality goods. With markets operating across borders, people on both sides of the world benefit from economic growth, increased wealth, and more jobs. So, what happens when you reduce trade barriers? Reducing barriers to FDI in parallel would amplify the positive impact of lower tariffs and reduce non-tariff barriers on productivity. The productivity gains from trade liberalization may also benefit from reforms in other areas, such as in labor or product markets. My name is Grey Chambuts OSP, a two-year student of political science in Blackfoot, and I'm your reporter for today. Reduction of traditional barriers and protectionist attitude among countries is also reflected in economic integration, which is the process through the, which nations lessen the economic significance of their borders. Example of which economic, economic facts such as North America, free trade agreement, and the World Trade Organization that reduce tariff of barriers letting goods and service more move freely economic integration may also be in the form of investor protection and offer cap offer capital mobility and package visa programs that assist firm search for willing workers and consistent it consists with economic principle with the economic principle when goods, service, and capital and labor move where and they are. Most efficiently employed and unemployed, economics can grow faster rates than they otherwise could. Krugman L. at 2005. An example of this outsourcing were in a, were in a transnational Corporation or TNC acquires good or service from for an outside or source or from other country. Where in a transnational corporation or TNC acquires good or service from an outside source or from another country. And my name is Regin Devo Haspi, your reporter for today.